The Hadigwai Youth Assembly is an all island event that is put on to spread love throughout all the communities and teach uh, island youth about governance through the Council of the Haida Nation and the different municipalities that they're governed through. It's a way for youth to have their voices heard and not be overpowered by the adults in the room. And um, I think Haida Gwaii is a really youth-driven place. I've seen like so many things that were powered by youth. On the first day, we usually have kind of first day jitters, young people kind of feeling their way through the process, not knowing where they fit in this space. It was absolutely instant. And that was so overt for me on the first day was young people feeling good immediately. We had tables being banged on, we had coffees going, we had water carbonating right before our eyes. We had pieces of candied salmon bouncing all over the place. It was just, it was, it was so wild to see. To me, that, 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 that's what stands out for me is young people just feeling good. <laughs> Yeah, so it takes place over three days, and they're very long days, but it's really worth it. It's, it's a lot of fun. The youth are participating in a plethora of challenges. Plethora. Um, they created their own superheroes. Um, they're out and about um, completing resolutions from past years at different youth assemblies. Uh, we've switched it up and we've given the youth council a lot more power this year, as in that the youth council actually is going to be picking the winners of the Haida Gwaii Youth Assembly. So we really look for teams that stand out and um, really represent the youth that are on Haida Gwaii because there are some really amazing youth on Haida Gwaii. Basically, it's all these teams and all these challenges that would make a really nice reality show, which is, I guess, sort of what you guys do. I think the poo emoji has really set a precedent where it's okay to be happy and stink. It's just the poo emoji is just there. It's just smiling, looking at you, letting you be stink. Hygiene is important, kids. We're at a time in our life where, okay, I don't know why I'm talking about hygiene right now. <laughs> Classic horror. Um, where was I going with this? I'm I don't know what else to say. Yeah, shower as often as you can, definitely. We're all in a tight space together. It'd be nice if everyone smelled nice. <laughs> okay, that's weird too. Wow, I'm really good at this. <laughs>
fat joke. <laughs> That's not funny. Um, I remember hearing about the camera crew dressing up in camouflage. Camouflage. Bow, 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 bow. I remember going like, wow, you're actually wearing camouflage. For those of you who did not come this year, you should have. Yeah. I hope that that death, that like glare showed up really well in the camera because, yeah. Okay. Good interview. This has helped me um, grow as a person. This has helped me grow into a leader. Um, this is inspired me to be a better person. I want to thank the young people for opening up their hearts and spending their lives with us. So they can share their lives so everybody could find their place. And don't forget the Heidegger Youth Assembly is about young people finding a special place so they can make their place, set their place, create a path for a better Heidegger. And the only way we can do that is by opening up our hearts and spirits. And we want to thank our young people for doing that. We need to just continue on uh, advancing and uh, you know, you guys are doing a great job. Uh, shout out to the Council of the Heidi Nation, shout out to Goi Trust, shout out to Harmony. Uh, y'all number one, y'all itchy band in my book, no Mr. Noodles, itchy band all around. We're going chicken broth, that's the only way to go. If you eat the shrimp, we can't be friends. Heidi Goi Assembly equals itchy band. No farting. <laughs>